everyone, Shout of the Rat, and for today's video, I will be showing you how you can train your rats to do a wall handstand, which is a trick where they back up onto a wall with their hind legs. Now there is a prerequisite trick for this trick, and that is backing up on cue. If you would like help teaching your rat to back up on cue, you can check out my trick tutorial video on how to do so, which I will be linking in the description down below. As for props, you will either need a movable slope, or in my case it will just be using some books. You will also need a wall or a vertical house for the final trick. You can also use a clicker if you wish. One final note before we start, and that is if you would like some more information on some of the basics of rat training, feel free to check out my ultimate guide to rat training video, which I will be linking in the description down below. Now to start training this trick, you first want to start by having your rat back up on cue a few times while using your second hand with a finger straddle to target them. Reward your rat for backing under your finger straddle two to three times, then place a book right behind your rat. Use a lure to guide them right in front of the book, then cue them to back up and place your finger straddle right in front of the book. Likely they will initially try to back around the book, so use your finger straddle to gently guide them fully backwards and onto the book. Once their back legs are on the book, you want to go ahead and reward them. Like with other backup tricks, you never want them to go forward to get the treat, so make sure that you bring the reward directly to them once they have backed onto the book. Now you want to reset your rat, using another treat to reset the trick by luring them forwards and rewarding them. Here you are rewarding them for walking forwards as you need to be able to reset the trick while training it, and as long as you are rewarding them for following the lure instead of letting them pop forward after backing up on cue, they won't get confused. Once your rat has been rewarded for walking forwards, go ahead and cue them to back up again, using your finger straddle to get them to back onto the book. Again, make sure to reward them as soon as their hind legs touch the book by bringing the treat directly to them. Once you have repeated this several times, your rat should now be backing onto the book themselves instead of trying to go around it, and once you see this, you can begin to fade out your finger straddle. To do this, you want to gradually raise your finger straddle each time you repeat this exercise until it is no longer touching your rat when they back up. At this point, they should know that backing their two hind legs onto the book should be their end goal, and once they do this, you want to make sure to reward them. Once they can back onto the book, you now want to add in a second book on top of the first one. Again, lure your rat into position and cue them to back up. If they back their hind legs onto the books, you can reward them, and if not, you may need to use your finger straddle to help them back onto both books a few times before fading it out again. Once your rat can consistently back onto two books, you now want to add in a third book. Like before, you may need to use your finger straddle at first to encourage them to back onto the book stack, but you should be able to fade this out pretty quickly. Once your rat can consistently back onto three books, you now want to add in a fourth one, and then a fifth one. At this point, how many books you need to keep adding depends on your rat's size, as your goal is for your rat to be backing up onto a stack of books that ends with them in a nearly vertical position. This is also the point at which you want to start rewarding your rat when their head and front paws are still on the floor after having backed their hind legs onto the book stack. Once your rat is backing up a nearly vertical book stack without any help, you can now switch to a wall or vertical house. Keep in mind that backing onto a wall or vertical house is more demanding than backing onto books, so make sure to go at your rat's pace and only work on this for a few minutes at a time. Now cue your rat to back up, and if they back up onto the wall, then reward them. They will likely need a bit of help at first though, and so if they don't fully back onto the wall, then you will want to use your finger straddle to guide them into a handstand position before rewarding them in that position. Another thing that helps is to place some barriers around the spot so that they don't try to back around your wall or house. Once you have practiced with the wall some, they should start to back up and onto it on their own when cued, and you can then fade out your finger straddle just as you did before. At this point, you can remove the barriers and start to wait a few seconds before rewarding your rat in order to encourage them to hold the handstand position. And that's all there is to it! Learning to do a wall handstand is a fun and challenging trick that is a great way to build up your rat's core strength. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope to see you next time. Bye!